today's special guest, Mr. Sinashish Borua FC, members of Bangladesh, uh, German Bangladesh Chamber of Commerce and Industry, distinguished guests, diplomats, ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Executive Board of BCCI, and members of Bangladesh German Chamber of Commerce and Industry, I, as President of the Chamber, would like to thank you for joining us at today's event. Board member is very a special category of membership of BCCI. As such, I would like to do more programs with board members, and today is the beginning. So please feel free to send your advice, suggestion, so that we can do more effective program with board members in future. We firmly believe that our success as a bilateral chamber is directly linked to the success of each individual member. Since January 2022, sorry, since January 2022, 20, due to COVID-19, and from February 2022, due to Ukraine war, businesses faced considerable challenges, but the economy is now stable. The private sector has over the years learned to survive in the face of formidable challenges. It is now up to us as the private sector to stand together to preserve our enterprises and prepare our businesses for a growth mode as we emerge from the difficulties of the last 42 months. German government eagerness to work with Bangladesh on shared challenges like climate change using their collective expertise to deepen trading relationship, spark economic growth and create jobs. There are huge opportunities for German companies to take advantage of the growing trade relationship between the Germany and Bangladesh. BCCI is going to organize more events related to German Supply Chain Act, Bangladesh's macroeconomic situation and outlook for export capabilities and challenges from Bangladesh to Germany as the foreign exchange, letter of credit opening, energy crisis, etc. We know German companies need input for risk assessment for doing business with their Bangladeshi partners as to whether to reduce or increase volume of business and the timing of the transaction. As a highly climate vulnerable nation, Bangladesh's annual growth domestic product could fall by as much as 9% by the middle of the century due to climate change, according to the World Bank. Bangladesh, therefore, needs to adapt rapidly to climate change while simultaneously assessing cleaner, more efficient technologies and support that support decades of development and growth. The country needs to shift away from unstable fossil fuel imports and limit emissions to the country aims to achieve high income status and eliminate absolute poverty by 2041. There's a lot of things to say, but I try to skip most of things because, anyway, the government view of the economy could be summed up in a few short phrases. If it moves, tax it. If it is moving, regulate it. And if it is stops moving, subsidizes. These are the three fundamentals any government will do. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to thank our valuable sponsors of this evening by reading out their names. We got two silver sponsors. They are Fokir Fashion Limited and Shorup Art and Advertising. Let's give them a big applause. Thank you. Thank you. We got several support sponsors uh, until we announced the name for the applause, so we'll give one applause only. <coughs> so they are Corona International, Don Group of Companies, Glow Freight Limited, Weber Power Solution, Western Bangladesh Laboratories Limited, Industrial Equipment Limited, Classic Freight Limited for their general support. Let's give them a big round of applause. <laughs> Thank you. In conclusion, I would like to restate my thanks to Mr. Sinashish Barua 
FCA and members of Bangladesh German Chamber of Commerce and Industry and guests. Our special thanks to Print and Electronics Media to cover this event and of course the West in Dhaka management for their excellent support and cooperation to hold this event at this venue. I wish you all an enjoyable and informative evening. Thank you. Now, as you know, this is a gold member appreciation night. So from among the gold member, may I take the opportunity to invite Mr. Mojibur Rahman, Managing Director of uh, Technovision Limited, uh, to, to, oh, sorry, it's a Power Vision Limited, to come to the dais to uh, say a few minutes about uh, his organization and uh, where he wants us to see uh, the support from BCCA. Thank you. Mr. Mojibur Rahman.